It's Straight Jacket Day here at Mucus Asylum Stadium here in Minneapolis, Craziana, home of the Insane Colts. The first 1,000 fans will receive a free straight jacket and a 500 volt lobotomy. Am I crazy? Or did I just see a fan throw himself off the upper deck in a garbage can with an M80 in his mouth? No, that's their mascot, Crazy Jimmy. <laughs> Quite the entertainer, isn't he? Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Mile High Chronic take on the Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, mm. uh, uh, no, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Yeah, you idiot. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hey. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. And the runner is crazy fast. Look at the path he's taking up field. Yeah, he's taking the cycle path, man. Just make that up yourself. Yeah. Pretty good, pretty good, Bricks. Thanks. Thanks. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. No, well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move them back nice. And he's got a chance. Looks like he just saw 100 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First and And it's first and ten. First and ten. Uh, is the game over yet? I gotta go to the vet to have him reattach my big toe to where my thumb was again. It just fell off for the third time today. I was barely even chewing on it. Second and three. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Oh, 
The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Oh, man, he just got skewered by those spikes. That was bloody and disgusting. Hey, anyone in the mood for a steak kebab? Make mine rare. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. <laughs> Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hey. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Hot, 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 hot. And the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. Tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And that'll bring him third and one. Hot one, hot two, hot. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Say what? Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. And that'll bring up second and one. First, nicely done. And it's first and ten. I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. And it's first and ten. Quarterback 
threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. They pick up three on a short pass. Second down and seven. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out because if he gets hit, he is dead. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, what a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Hey, did your mother ever tell you don't run with a chainsaw? says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> First down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Runs it in for the touchdown. <laughs> well, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> and it's 
first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field, literally. Third down and five. They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't know which way forward is now. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. And we're at the two-minute warning. Second and three. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot, hot. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. He is fighting for every yard. Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Ah, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot three. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! And yeah, big deal. Mr. Beat for Brains ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called... It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. Oh, and that's when
what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a cop. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Grim, can I kill him? If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's gonna have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Quarterback can be hurting or dead. Hey man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Second down in a mile. He refuses to go down. They pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. Third down and three. Hey, guys, this isn't funny. Okay. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. Nice catch. And You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. My big brother told me as soon as you get there, stab the first kid you see and no one will mess with you. So I get off the bus at the camp, some kid runs up to me and stabs me. And it's first and ten. Nine. Nine. One. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. No, I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. He's supercharged and can electrocute any... Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. The 30. The 20. He's at the 10. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scored! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, eight. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that'll give him four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And that play went nowhere fast. No game. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Second and three. Hot one, hot two, three. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. Now this reminds me of a lap dance I had by a skeleton once. Oh yeah, after the main ball at that club six feet under? Yeah, my wife could smell the bone there on me when I got home. Big trouble! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. He just got crushed. And it's first and ten. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, that guy. Bam, say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Oh, that is such bullshit. I got money on this game. These guys need to talk to the rep about those calls. If I talk, I mean, stop them into the ground. They're back up here on first, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore.
First down and forever. Touchdown! And he rips off a game-breaking run for the score. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Third down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 down give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off he is deadly in the open field bricks and it's first and ten and that pass is good for about five yards second down and five hot, hot one hot two hot If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Second down and long. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 If he had getting killed by the <laughs> team, he could his bucket list on his bucket list. He could cross that off. And that's a nice run for a first down. First down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Friends. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. And he punched his way out of that tackle. The receiver makes a grab for five yards.
Second down and five. First down and five. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and two. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. This isn't the devil brick, it's just one of them. Oh, that don't make it any less scary. <laughs> don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. Second down and five. Not one. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and five. Not, not one. Not two. This guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. The defense calls a second timeout. They really need to make a stop here. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Oh, and the fans really loving his dance. Gets down and they can kiss their skin goodbye. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, nice hit! Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Second 
second down in. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. First and ten. This guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. The Colts walk away losers today. And they're losers every day in my book. They battled hard but still got their butts handed to them. Gross. I hope there weren't any hog butts involved. I kinda like our butts, especially with some Deshaun mustard and a smoked pickle relish. Not bad living. Let's go down to the field and see what the game's MVP thinks of today's outcome. Brim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every other.